Now we're at A13, which is the last block of the first row. And there's a little bit of a discrepancy here. We've got, we've got this picture that indicates that these tips are focus fabric and so are these, but this is not what the block in the, in the photo is. So when Paper Pieces made the kit, they made this as the block. But personally, I like this kind of a thing. The first time I made this with my first quilt, I did make this block. But what I wanna do this time is what I did is I've got my pieces, but these pieces here, I've already, you know, cut them out. But what I'm gonna do actually is I've made a pencil line from this bend to this bend. And I'm gonna take it off the fabric. I'm gonna cut this triangle off, actually. And you don't have to do this. Um, I Like I said, I made the block the first time with no problem. But um, I'm gonna do it this time just because I wanna see the difference. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these and cut these papers off and put these on the yellow. And then I can come back and start assembling. All right, so I've separated the points out so I can make the block look like the photo here. So all I did, again, all I did was cut the tip off right here and make a rectangle and a point. Now for assembly, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna form this point back. So I'm gonna put these two back together with the dual colors. And then that way I can make my row so I can make these three pieces into a row, these three pieces into a row, these three pieces into a row, and then I can work on the outside. So that's essentially the goal. But right now I'm gonna assemble this piece back to one piece. So I've got my pieces connected. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna base this square and then make this a row. And I'm also gonna baste these other yellow pieces so I can make these into a row. So first thing I'm gonna do is base the square and make that row. So I've assembled my center row, we'll leave that right there, and I've basted my, my diamond pieces. I did this straight side and this straight side, the short sides, and then I did these longer sides. So all of my tags are going in a clockwise formation. I just did them all the same. So um, now I'm going to assemble this into a row and this into a row. So we got these other two rows assembled here. So now I'm going to put all three of them together to form the center star before working on the outside sections. So I've assembled the center star completely at this point. And now I'm gonna baste, I've started to baste these two and then we'll attach these as we go around. So I've basted all of my outer pieces and I've attached the top and the bottom sections. So now I'm just going to attach the two side sections. So I've attached the side sections to my center section and now my A13 block has been completed.